Hi guys, how are you today? So, um, I haven't made a video in a really long time now. Um, I've just been so busy uh, with doing some doll stuff and um, and such. Um, I bought uh, this spring a resin sole doll, a custom order doll, and um, that video got lost somehow, um, so I can't find it. So, so I couldn't do a box opening video, which I wanted. Oh, and then I also got a kitten, of course, and she keeps me busy every day. Yeah, yeah. And um, so I have been uh, trying to sell a few of the dolls I have because they just don't fit into my plans anymore. So uh, they have been my main focus, so to speak, when it comes to I try to, to do wigs and maybe some outfits and such just to make them more, them more attractive and maybe easier to sell. Um, so right now the resin soul doll that I'm doing uh, happens to look like a night elf from uh, World of Warcraft and I have never played the game so um, it was a friend who pointed it out so uh, I'm actually doing a doll armor for the first time so that is a fun experience uh, and a project but it takes a lot of work and a lot of time um, so yeah, um, another update that actually is the reason why I'm doing this video today is because I just got a shipping notice from uh, a new company that is so cool and just seems uh, really great. Um, and it's a mother and son company, uh, Phoenix Dolls, and they had a pre-order for a head. Um, uh, the first head they did was L, uh, which is lovely, and then the second head they were working on was uh, called May. Uh, which was more towards um, Asia inspired with the facial structure and they also just happened to uh, one day when I was looking for specifically heads for my doll's town body uh, I just went into the, their page and saw that they had a pre-order for a May head, but it was a little bit different because it was an Android head. So they had taken the May head sculpt and um, made grooves and uh, and I think they are like balls or uh, something. Um, but they made it into a cyborg or Android, and I was like, that that's that head. I just have to have it and then when I finally came to that conclusion I was like oh my what am I supposed to do now because my entire doll universe or, or worlds or fantasy whatever you want to call it has been for the past year I think uh, I've all uh, um, uh, been about Nordic mythology. Uh, so all my dolls uh, has a part in that and I have been talking about it in my videos and I've been so excited about it and just suddenly there's a head that changes everything and forces me to rethink my entire doll universe and um, that is what that head is. Um, that head for me was just... It was... Uh, it forced me to, to, to change my dolls uh, and actually 
somehow I feel better now because now it feels like the dolls are made into what they were supposed to be in the first place. I just didn't know it. Um, so uh, my doll uh, genre will be instead towards sci-fi. Uh, and you know space and aliens and all that kind of stuff um, and since Khan, my, my biggest boy, is already well he's in the Star Trek franchise you know the style and stuff so I would take inspiration, inspiration from Star Trek and Star Wars of course I love Star Wars it's the greatest movie franchise ever, sorry, all the Trekkies out there, but yeah, uh, I absolutely love it, and um, if they ever do Adam Driver head for Kylo Ren, I will buy it, no matter what it costs, just so you know, um, so um, that's what I will do, I will take inspiration from that, and maybe from Alien, and it would be really cool to do like an Ellen Ripley inspired doll. I don't know. Uh, and of course, Guardian of the Galaxy. Um, I I don't know why, but I really dig uh, Nebula. And she will be kind of the inspiration somewhat for my uh, Android Mayhead. Um, since she's such a lovely head that... Um, I don't know if I will put a wig on her actually because they were really uh, really smart when they um, when they sculpted the head in 3D uh, they made sure that the line which will which uh, separates the head from the head cap uh, looks natural um, compared to the other lines on the head so um, I think it will look really good uh, once it has a face up and uh, so it doesn't need a wig in my opinion um, so yeah uh, one, once I have the head I will do a box opening and I will put it on the body and then I will just start working on all my dolls to slowly change them uh, so, so clothes and and stuff like that and I still need to find a few bodies um, I have I have the twiggling oryx doll in vivid a resin on uh, on layaway my first layaway so it's always a bit scary uh, and then I couldn't resist so I sold a couple of stuff and also bought the twiggling Eloy head in white um, because the head with, uh, I don't know which body yet, uh, but that head will be painted to look, uh, take inspiration from Jayla, uh, the, um, for you who don't know, the Star Trek uh, movie, um, she is one of the alien races, so the alien in that franchise, um, in the latest movie, so uh, white resin skin and markings and stuff I think I would take inspiration from that or if I feel inspired I might blush it to another color I don't know yet um, and then I need a body for my resin head boy pink resin head and I also wait for my doll Pam cuckoo head that I bought from uh, the lovely Jade Love and I think that is it actually it's always hard when you uh, for me uh, I don't I don't I don't know really how to do these update videos I don't know who will be interested in watching them and and stuff uh, for me most of the videos that I watch on VEDs are about box opening, body reviews, tips and tricks um, that is the main videos I watch so that is what I prefer to make myself but uh, if you are interested in me doing more dolly videos, you know, updates and just random talk um, 
just write it in the comment section and I might consider starting doing those wine and dollies even though I don't drink but you know tea and dollies or just dolly chat or something like that I um uh, I'm just I'm not that comfort comfortable in front of a camera actually so um, uh, it will be a challenge it's much easier for me if I have facts to talk about rather than just random rambling like I'm doing now so I'm trying to in my head focus on all the stuff I want to get said but anyway that is it for today uh, that is my my update and the next video I will do will be the box opening for the Android May from Phoenix Dolls and I, I can't wait, I'm so excited. I was like jumping up and down when I read it on Facebook uh, and got my mail. Uh, so we will see when that will be, hopefully uh, sometime in the beginning of next week. And after that I, uh, I think I will do maybe a body review of my resin sole body because it's a 68 centimeter female body but with a male male uh, arms um, and different head and stuff so uh, it might be uh, interesting for someone so I think I will do that too but yeah anyway thank you so much for watching I hope you're doing great all of you and stay safe out there bye